Hey everyone, so in this tutorial, I'll be sharing with you three easy and quick ways of animating a loading sign. So let's get started. I've already created a comp and a solid background of HD dimensions. Now let's create a circle. Okay, so let's create one more circle and place it somewhere here and let's change its color press ctrl D and copy the same circle under the same shape layer and change its color as well repeat the same process and place this circle somewhere here so this is what the final look will look like let's rename our layers to loader and this one to loading copy the loader layer and keep it above the loading shape layer and let's change its name so there is no confusion and change the track mat of loading to alpha mat Let's remove the fill of this to get rid of the white area and let's add a stroke. Now let's add turbulent displace effect to our loading shape layer and change the amount to somewhat 450 and reduce the size to 50. So this is what it will look like. To give it a loading, press Alt and hold on the stopwatch and put expression time star 100. So this is what we will achieve, a sort of liquidy uh, loading animation. You can adjust the circle as per your convenience so to achieve whatever um, feel you are looking for also let's add a choker as well so that it it gives a sort of a liquidy effect like this let's move to our second animation now Let's create a small circle and set it its anchor point to the center. Now let's add repeater to our circle and change the value of copies to 4 and increase the position size a bit so that there is horizontal spacing between the circles let's change the offset to minus 2 and let's put a keyframe to our scale property and change it to 90 and after few frames increase it to 110 and then again restore it to 90 so this is what the animation would turn out let's adjust the graph a little bit Now I don't want to copy and paste my keyframes again and again so I'll put a loop into the scale press alt and hold the stopwatch and go to the property and let's add loop out duration so it will create a loop now 
so this sort of animation is quite um, easy and to work with where you don't want to give the where you want to give a loading animation but don't want to put so much efforts into it so this is a great way now let's move to our third animation let's create a text and i'll be writing loading as a generic you can choose whatever text you want to if you are making for some specific purpose and then I'll adjust the size a bit and now I will add cylinder effect to my text layer so this is what it will look like so we'll have to adjust the radius a bit and also rotation so that we get a clear picture so let's change the rotation to 15 degrees and let's change the light height to 100 so that we get a plain white fill let's put a keyframe to our rotation y let's put a keyframe to rotation y for 120 degrees and now let's add now let's add one more stroke to enhance our loading sign and let's also change the cap to round cap so to give a more finished look Now let's let's copy the exact property and paste it into the stroke layer. So we will so we will achieve the exact same look. Let's place the shape layer below the text. Now what is happening is the stroke is the stroke layer is moving in sync with our cylinder uh, with our text layer. So I'll change the rotation of Y a bit so that we can see some difference in the movement. So now we can clearly establish there is a difference in the movement. Let's again make one more stroke. Okay, I really like this color. And do the same exact thing with this as well. Let's reduce the stroke size a bit. And let's change its direction. So that all the three elements look. Give a, so that all the three elements give an individual animation and effect. Let's adjust it a bit. You can you can alter the changes as per your um, convenience. You can also change. You can also give animation to the x axis or z axis. I wanted to keep it minimal and subtle. Thank you so much for watching. You can also follow me on Instagram to see more of my stuff.